Who, what is up, everybody? Happy Saturday. We are here on a Saturday, just kind of taking a look at a couple of things. And I wanted to jump in. We do our um, Watch Me Builds on Friday. And I thought this would be a timely way to show you how to take, <clears throat> excuse me, how to take our samples within the UPEX library and adapt them to be your own. If you've ever heard the phrase, give a man a fish, feed him for a day, teach a man to fish, feed him for a lifetime. That is what the purpose of sample templates are, okay? We don't mean these things to be, hey, we've gone ahead and taken care of the agency for you. If we did, we would be just feeding you for a day and you would not really have much of a business. So yesterday we went through and we came up with a, we were in the med spa space, which is here. And we came up with a new offer, which I think is kind of cool because it's actually an offer that I was researching for a, a client just last week. And I'll show you the difference between what we created in the scrum and then what you guys see here available now within the Upex library. So here you've got the body copy, you've got the greeting copy, you've got everything built out, you've got the lead form image, and then you've got all of these cool um, ad campaigns that uh, we made within the sample template. So let me go ahead and show you, I went ahead and I went to the top and I imported this into my own agency and we'll go ahead and check that out. My templates, we'll go ahead and check that out now. Uh, Med Spa and then fat transfer and lipo, uh, laser liposuction. And then here it is. So you'll notice if you go back in the video that my ad copy has changed a little bit. I've added some emojis. I've added this cool thermal scan here. I've added this FDA approval uh, message here, and I've changed up some of the ad copy. I wanted that to give me a start, but I don't wanna just plug and play and use that without looking in the, into this myself. And then we have the images, okay? So in terms of the actual ads that show, I've got two image campaigns, which were created again within the sample template itself. And then I've got two videos that I created that I want to uh, test out alongside of these images and see how they work. So let me actually just hit pause real quick and I'll show those to you. All right, so this is the video version that I created. We'll go ahead and watch this. I don't use sound on these, it doesn't matter. People don't watch with sound anyway. So we've got the demonstrative part of the video that's showing them something very interesting, something that makes them curious. And then we've got the demonstration part of the treatment. So hopefully you can see how we're using the templates library as a starting uh, position. One of the cool things that you can get from that, I mean, I think the ad copy, the body copy, the images, the ads are very good at giving you some direction, okay? But you can actually, in fact, plug and play. I didn't change anything on the targeting. I mean, some of these things in terms of completion call to action, that kind of information, really, you don't need to, you know, think too hard about those. But I do think that your offer, your body copy, those things should be unique to you should be, you know, part again, of your art, you are using Upex to leverage and scale your art, you don't use the sample library to shortcut the system and have the same campaigns as everyone else. No, you're using that as a starting point. And I think it's a great resource for anybody to get ideas and to see what else, you know, what other kind of niches or opportunities are out there. So thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next video, I guess.